there were people that I was supposed to hang out with that I had to tell them, look, like I can't hang out right now. I got other pressing issues. been so 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 long since we made a video but it was all for a very good reason I mean I haven't been social uh, and that was all because I was going for my real estate license if you guys have been watching us for a while you know like two years ago I had started the process of going for my real estate license and I ended up getting busy with work and stuff like that and I didn't end up going through with and getting my actual license well today I had my real estate license test, the, the state test, and well guys, you're now looking at a Florida licensed real estate agent. I freaking passed my test. Feels so good. Missed vlogging. I still have to edit, literally today, I need to edit the vlog from like three weeks ago when I went to go visit my, my parents. Um, but yeah, like really big things are coming. And what are you getting ready to do, miss? Well, Mrs. <laughs> I'm going for an interview now. I've been working with like a company for um, like a nanny agency company, but that job's not starting for a while. So if I can find something before then, then I'll take it. But yes, so um, I'm just super excited. So literally, I left Harris yesterday. Which a lot of people are probably like, dude, are you crazy? And the number one thing they tell you when you get into the real estate in industry, don't leave your daytime job right away. But we're trying to get back to Orlando anyway. We don't like Palm Bay. We only moved here. And like I said, if you've been watching our vlogs for a while, you know we only moved back to Nisha's mom's house because I was supposed to be getting back into the military. That didn't happen for multiple reasons. And uh, that we were not gonna just, we're just not even gonna get into that. But. We, we came down here for those reasons and obviously I didn't get back in so now we're trying to get back to Orlando and so where was I going with that? Uh, oh, not to leave your day job. Oh, not to leave your daytime job and there's a love bug right there. I know. Freaking love bugs. Florida. You gotta love it. I love oh. everything about Florida except for the stupid love bugs. We're in love bugs. He's in the anyway. little stupid black bugs. But anyway, like I was saying. Um, yeah, they say don't leave your daytime job, but we're trying to get back to Orlando anyway, and I, like my job was just really, really slow paced. I literally had to be super lazy that to keep up yeah. with people. We're, we don't have like rent to pay right now, yeah. so it's not. We have our cars, we have my phone. Yeah. Those are our only bills right and now. And I, I have a job right now, so I'll be able to pay everything. Exactly, and I'm still going to get something part-time at Maybe. least to... We're not sure. We're not sure yet. I'm saying yes. You She's saying to. focus on real estate, yeah. but um, yeah, we'll 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 iron out all the details. But um, like that's the main reason why I left here. So left here yesterday, went and took my state exam today, passed, and I have two interviews already lined up for this afternoon with brokers. Yeah. And, and someone that you met like a, over a year ago. Yeah, over a year ago, and he remembered broker. me. Yeah, and he remembered you, and he was like, you know. He pretty much was like, I'll make time yeah. to talk with you today. Exactly. So, so I'm, I'm super excited. Looking forward to what's to come. I mean, I, ah, you guys don't understand. I almost cried at the testing center. Like, the lady that was there, she was the same lady that was the test proctor when I first took the test. She remembered me, yeah. and I literally um, I almost lost it. I almost cried in there. But enough about me. We're on to go get Nisha to her job interview. Well, how'd it go? It was good. He's still looking for other people as well. So there's like multiple positions open or? There's two. One for the assistant, which I, I'm not qualified for. And then one for a sterilization person. I'm not qualified for that, so. Ooh. All right, so we are both starving. Haven't eaten all day. This last month has just been Ridiculous. I think we've only what been eating one meal a day for like the last month, right? Pretty much I'm lost. I don't know what to do with my life oh My goodness. 
but we're gonna go and have a celebratory brunch, I guess. Yeah. At, it's probably like a little dinner. A little dinner? Not brunch, it's a little dinner. Yeah. But we're gonna go and eat some Red Robin because I just found out how good they are and they have endless fries. Like, genius. Like, why don't other restaurants do that? That's so genius. Well, other restaurants have like peanuts or chips, which, oh, the chips from Chili's are so good. Well, yeah, that's what <gasps> I was gonna ask you. Did you want Moles, Panera, or Red Robin? But we're already here. Okay. See what I did there? This is what I wanted. You're so <laughs> annoying, and I knew you wanted this. <laughs> Three hours later. <laughs> is that good, Lou? Here. Was that good? I'm just a little pissed at mommy because she ate all of it, huh? <laughs> <laughs> so freaking cute. You're so cute. All right, guys, so we made it back home. This one took a doo-doo. Stop. After. <laughs> I had a root beer float, because I, I felt like a little kid. I saw a root beer float on the menu. I was like, oh, yeah, I love those. I haven't had one in, like, years. But I forgot I'm lactose intolerant. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, that's my Anyway, so we have some more good news. Yeah. This one has, it's. Well, I just had the interview. For the, this broker that I want to work for yeah. that I've known since two years ago. Yeah, and when you first started. Yeah. yeah, when I first started this process. And um, basically I had an interview with him and then now on Monday I have a meeting. A phone meeting. interview. Yeah, yeah, I had a phone interview just th like a little while ago. Yeah. And then I have a meeting in person, not an interview, but a meeting with the broker, the, my potential broker and my potential pr coach. productivity coach. Yeah. Um, on Monday, and they're gonna give me like the lay of the land and everything like that. And hopefully, we can get to sign in. Yeah. Well, I have I have an attorney in my back pocket, you know, now that yeah. I know. So I'm gonna have him look over everything on my contracts before I sign anything. Make sure there's no legal jargon in there that I don't know. Um, and just have him look over everything. Make sure everything's on the up and up, and uh, sign my contract and get to work. And start. Ooh. The only thing that's like. Do they know what's happening in two weeks? No. I mean, it doesn't really matter. No, it doesn't it's matter. Right. But the only thing that's like making me mad is like this one's leaving in two weeks. Again. To go to Connecticut for two weeks. Because my little sister's graduating from high school and I yeah. can't miss that. Literally, this is my third trip up there this year. That's yeah. the most I've traveled up there since we've been down here. And we've officially been here two years. Yeah. Well, I'm just, I'm mad at the timing of it, because it's just like, I am, but I'm not, because it's like, I can work from anywhere. I know, but... And, uh, I almost said his name, <laughs> the coach. Oh but God. the coach, I can work with him over the phone and stuff, like, hey, like, I got this, this is what's going on, what should I do? Yeah, I just, I want the two weeks to go by fast, so that way, come back and just... Oh, yeah. Okay, See, Philly, Philly Philly's soon. telling you. <laughs> <laughs> So can you guys tell that we just went for a really long walk? Mm, that one over there too. She's like half dead. She won't even drink any water. Hi, Emma. <laughs> Good girl, Lily. Did you have fun on our walk? Did you have fun? You're so cute and spunky. And little I bright eyes. Spunky. No, I said she's spunky, silly. All right, so a popsicle? Yes, please. Okay, so we're coming to the end of the day, and we're still trying to figure out what we're doing tomorrow. We had made uh, not a bet, but we, like we just said that if I passed my test today, that we'd go to Disney tomorrow to celebrate. But we don't know if we want to go or not. I I want to go. Do you want to go? Yeah. Do you guys want to go? I think they want to go to Disney. You hear Jacob? Jacob speaking Fortnite in the background. <laughs> yes? No? Maybe so? Maybe so. You want to talk a little more? I mean, if, if we're planning on going, we need to go to bed kind of early. When we went to bed early enough yesterday. We went to bed at, well, you went to bed at 8. I was asleep by like 9, I think. But you slept all the way through pretty much. I did. Yeah, I slept from 9 until 6.45.
I had to get good rest for my test this morning. Clearly, that paid off. That's Ozzy. They are so dead right now, it's not even funny. Emma doesn't know what to do with herself. No, I think she's finally gonna go drink some water. She's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Lily, where are you? That's so bright, look at you. Oh, I didn't want you to get up, baby. I didn't, I didn't want you to get up. Oh, God. oh my goodness. Oh, because she knows what I got in my hand. She wants some of this, but you know Daddy doesn't share. You want some, you better go see Mommy. No, oh, she too dead. You're just dripping all over the place. She's that lazy. She don't want to get up. <laughs> you got it? You got a scoochie? <laughs> Good girl. All right, well... The girls are inside cooling off and Philly coming to the window as I'm leaving. I need to clean out my car, at least the inside, just getting all the trash out. Like I said, these last three weeks have been absolutely ridiculous and I'm usually really good about keeping my car clean. I'm usually getting after Naisha about her car being so dirty because her car always looks like a sandbox honestly there's always like tons of sand she has beach gear in there still from like when we went to the beach like months and months ago so I'm just going to get all this trash out of here because it's kind of bad guys it's kind of gross all right so I got tons of dirt all down there coffee cups cologne chips gum wrappers fruit cups oh my big old water jackets it doesn't look that bad to you guys, but trust me, this is not how I keep my car. I guess you could say I've been a little bit of a hoarder or something. I don't know. I just cleaned my car out, babe. There was so much trash. I know, because you're dirty. <laughs> is she she's got to be kidding are you kidding me <laughs> your your car is always a sandbox i bet you you still got them beach chairs in there from how many months ago actually i do not oh yeah they're there now there. finally only took you like six months those we don't even go to the beach like that so it's like not even like oh you know it's a good thing to have your car you live in florida you go to the beach we don't go to the beach you go to the beach like twice a year seriously we've been here two years i think we've been to the beach all of Four times? Yeah. Well, I went one more time than you. Maybe maybe like five or six. Maybe five or six in two years. That's that's not a lot. And we're literally like a half an hour from the beach. Yeah, exactly. I don't know what, I mean, I do know why we don't go to the beach because I don't really like the beach. I like it to sleep. Yeah, I like to sleep by the ocean and hear but the waves. But sometimes it's too and, hot here. Like, yeah. too hot. You gotta go like You're in like, like February. Get your vlogging Baby, life. because no, this freaking no, thing no. is broken. Get your vlogging life to get, get it together. I wish you guys get could it. see how floppy this freaking I, thing oh, is. Oh, and I wonder why. And I wonder why. Because it's, it, because, it's old wait, and wait, cheap. Wait. Please tell me who broke it. The stupid manufacturers that made it so cheap. <laughs> like literally, this thing is like, if I don't hold it like this, you guys are just going to go <laughs> like that. Anyway, I have to call my sister back because I'm helping her finish her senior project about um, soldiers with PTSD, I think, or something like that. Oh, she's still learning on that? Yeah. I thought her thing was, like, making clothes. No, that's separate. That That's, like, I don't, I don't know. She has, like, two projects, apparently. That's why she was so stressed out. <laughs> but she's graduating in, like, three weeks. That's why I'm going up there in two weeks. And I'm gonna be up there for two weeks. Mm. So this one's not too happy about me leaving for two weeks, but it's okay. 
she'll miss me and then she'll love me even more when I come back. Right, baby? Or I'll disown you. Or that. On that happy note, um, we're just gonna end the vlog because I have to call her so we can make this little video for her project and I'm getting eaten alive by bugs, but it's gonna be too loud in the house, so I'm just gonna have to brave it out here and deal with this crazy cycle on my own. But thanks for being part of our day. Good night from NJ and Philly. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, Bye guys. guys.